If your business generates £333 per day, then over a 30-day month, you'll be earning £10,000 profit every single month. In today's video, I want to break down the numbers so you know exactly how you can achieve this numbers with a dropshipping business. If you're new to the channel, my name's James Eardley. I've generated just under £1 million in sales so far with my dropshipping businesses over the last couple of years. And with my channel, I bring out weekly videos to teach you how to do the same. And this topic is going to be about how the numbers work so that you can generate £333 every single day. Now, the reason why I want to make this video about how much you can make per day is because it's more tangible to think about how can I make that money in a day. If you start to think about how can I make 120 grand a year, that becomes quite difficult to break out how are you going to actually achieve that large goal. But if we can break it right down to what you need to achieve every single day, then £333 a day over the course of a year will add up to you generating 120k and it's all done from a laptop so you've got independence to work from wherever you want whenever you want on your own terms so let's break it down now first of all how can we generate 333 pounds in profit every single day well if we're going to start with a drop shipping business we need to be selling products that will generate us large profit per order so that we don't need to be fulfilling thousands of orders every single day You've got the choice of doing high ticket dropshipping or low ticket dropshipping. I do high ticket dropshipping, which means the products that I sell are an average of about £1,500 as an average order value. And that's typical as we see across high ticket stores. So I'm selling products. Think about things like barbecues or sheds or greenhouses. Uh, it is large products, large items that you can think about and you walk past. Those types of items are the sort of things that sell really well with high ticket stores. When you sell high ticket products, you only need to sell one per day to make a profit of £333 every single day. Or you've got the choice if you go into a low ticket dropshipping business where you're selling cheaper products that are perhaps £100 or less. So think about selling things like fidget spinners were big back in the day, Bluetooth game pads, those type of things. That's a low ticket store and you'll need to sell thousands of items that are all worth £30 each in order to generate the same amount of profit as you would from a high ticket dropshipping store. So the differences are vast in terms of the amount of admin when you have lots of sales compared to the amount of admin when you only have one or two sales per day. Now we've decided that we're going to go with high ticket dropshipping. Think about how we generate that £333 profit per day. Well, let's break down the numbers. Let's break down what you need to achieve to get to that. So if you're selling large products and they are fancy barbecues, outdoor kitchens, and your average order value across your store is £1,500, then when you've got partnered with the suppliers that will supply these products, the average gross margin that you'll get with the supplier is 30%. That means that you'll keep 30% of the sale price for yourself. So when you sell products and say £1,500 is your average order value, and 30% of £1,500 is £450, which is your gross profit, which you'll keep. Now, from that £450, you need to spend some money to acquire that customer that purchases the product for £1,500. So out of your £450, you'll spend an amount of money to generate that customer, whether that's through Google ads, Facebook ads, however you advertise, there'll be a certain amount of that profit that you have spent to get that customer onto your store and to convert them. So from that £450, if you want to make £333 profit from that order, you have £117 to spend on acquiring that customer. Now, the way I suggest you do that is by setting up a Google Ads campaign that will send people to your website when they're searching for the exact product that you sell. So those people are looking for what you sell. And so with the £117, that gives you plenty of room to acquire that customer with Google Ads. It might take some time to optimize your ads and make sure you're as profitable as possible but you can get set up with the right way of google ads marketing and only spend 117 pounds to generate that customer and then you've got 333 pounds profit after ad spend which goes to your business now that 333 pounds is yours to either reinvest in the business or to put it into your back pocket and remove it from the business as a dividend or a salary to pay yourself and that's yours. Obviously, there's tax involved. There'll be corporation tax on the profits you gener generate. There'll be income tax on the money that you take out of the business as well for yourself personally. But with an accountant, you can do that all in the most tax efficient way possible. 
and you'll be generating £10,000 net profit in your business and you'll be able to have a large sum of that after tax. So I wanted to keep this video very simple and to the point so you understand exactly how you can get to your goal of 10 grand a month or £333 per day. The first step in setting up one of these businesses so that you can generate that money is to choose a high ticket product to sell. Now, the first link in my description is a list of 101 different profitable niche ideas for a high ticket drop shipping business. So check that out, go through that list, validate to see which one makes sense, and then you can start to build stores around that. If you want more details about the process, I'd recommend checking out the book that's been written by Lewis Smith called The Home Turf Advantage, which is also the next link in my description. And that will take you through the step-by-step -step guide to validate that niche from the list. And from there, it will teach you all of the steps that you need to take to build a store, sell in suppliers, put your marketing campaign together until you're generating the goal income that you want to generate. Hopefully this video today has been helpful. If you want more details and a breakdown on paper of how you get to 10K a month, I've also released another video, which will be on screen now. So until then, I'll catch you in the next video.